hello again in the last video we have seen how to create a shadow effect using xml cropples today we can learn how to create dashed lines using the same open an empty android project and open its activity main load xml in here drag and drop another constraint layout we can use this dashed line to uh, mark important portions of our layout if you have something uh, that is the user shouldn't miss you can put it in a box and give it a dashed line outline so that it will always catch the user's eye i have a uh, drag and drop uh, constraint layout and let's name it cl important or something like that and click this button to connect all the constraints and change the height to 100 dp and we can put margins 24 dp on the left and right now add a text view inside that constraint layout Connect all the constraints to make it center and leave all margins to 8 dp. Now it's in the center and let's change the background of this constraint layout so that it has a dashed line outline. Now create a XML file in the drawable directory, call it lines. Click on the text tab here and change the selector to shape and change the shape using android colon shape select rectangle inside the shape tag open stroke tag give it a width of 1 dp uh, a dash width of 1 dp again and a dash cap of 1 dp and the color of black Hash 000 gives it black. You can see in the preview here there's dashed lines, but it's so small we can't see it properly. Let's change the width, dash width to 4 dp. Now you can see each dash is a bit larger. We change the dash gap also. You can see now each dash is separated enough. Let's give it a dash width of 8 dp. Okay, now that looks good. If you want to make the lines a bit more thicker, we can change the width value here. Like this, you can see. You can change the thickness. Let's give it one. Close this and back in our main XML file. <coughs> Change the background of this constraint layout to newly created XML file. Now you can see in here that constraint layout we have added now has dashed line outline. 